Hey everybody, Scott Spritzer here, DocSports.com. Our update for Friday, June 14th, 2019. We've got a free pick coming up in just a moment. First, an offer going on today only over at DocSports.com. You can receive 25% off daily, weekly, or monthly packages in baseball and or the WNBA. And you can use this on as many handicappers as you want me, anybody else. It's as simple as that. Again, 25% off Major League Baseball and or WNBA weekly, daily, and monthly packages. Now there's a code word to use and that code is FRY25. That's F-R-Y-25. Give you a quick example of how this works. Let's say you go to my homepage at DocSports.com. You want to purchase my weekly baseball package, for example. You click on the weekly package. A little box will pop up. It'll tell you to enter the code. And again, that code is F-R-Y-25. FRY25. Daily, weekly, monthly packages, baseball and or the WNBA, as many campers of your choice. And it's only good today from 5 a.m. Eastern Time until 11 p.m. Eastern Time on Friday. And then prices go back to normal. Check it out over at DocSports.com. And I'll tell you what, it's a good day to jump into my baseball because I have a rare seven-unit main event going in Friday's Major League Baseball action. And you're going to love the price on this game, by the way. It's over at DocSports.com. It'll be available at 11.30 a.m. Eastern, 8.30 a.m. A.M. Pacific. We're 2-0 this week with our elite level baseball plays. We won a few days ago with a five-unit play. We had a six-unit winner uh, yesterday in Major League Baseball. Seven-unit going on Friday. It's our lone premium baseball pick for Friday. Again, it's over at DocSports.com. And if you get that 25% off today on Friday, you'll be able to use it on the daily, weekly, or monthly package, baseball and or the WNBA. Here's what happened yesterday for us. We won in the NBA with the Toronto Raptors. We finished up this season on a 45-20 seven run going back two plus three months and we finished up the season in the black we had another winning season in the nba thanks for those of you who jumped on board i do appreciate it and we'll go into next year's nba finals by the way 46 and 25 since 2008 in the nba finals we went four and two in this 2019 nba finals uh, run we had toronto last night nice win over the golden state warriors and again i can't wait until they lace them up and get going again next fall after another winning season in the NBA. Uh, we also had that six unit winner in baseball. We went one and one overall in baseball, won the six unit, lost the two unit. So a nice profit in Major League Baseball on Thursday. Wanted to mention that a couple of people have DM'd me, so I want to clear this up. Last night, uh, the Cardinals-Mets game went into the bottom of the ninth, tied at four. They never got to the bottom of the ninth. The game was suspended. Here's what happens for betting purposes only. Because the Mets didn't get their chance to come up and bat in the bottom of the ninth with the game tied at four, the game reverts to the previous inning, the previous full inning. So they take the final score, I should say D score, at the end of the eighth inning, and that's the score that's used for betting purposes when it comes to the side. That means the Mets win the game four to two at the sports books. It's suspended for Major League Baseball, but it's a win on the Mets and a loss on the Cardinals if you were involved from a betting perspective. I hope that clears it up. Anyway, after a nice day yesterday, and by the way, we didn't play in the WNBA yesterday. There was just one game didn't care for it, but we are in action on Friday. Here's what's going for us on Friday. The seven-unit main event in baseball, a five-unit play in the WNBA. That'll be over at DocSports.com. Both of those plays, 11.30 a.m. Eastern, 8.30 a.m. Pacific. Right now as I speak, I've got my one play for week one in the CFL, a five-unit play. It goes on Saturday. It's available right now over at DocSports.com. So all three picks will be available probably by the time you're waking up and watching this on Friday. Friday morning. Again, CFL available right now. Baseball 7 unit, WNBA 5 unit, both available 11.30 a.m. Eastern, 8.30 a.m. Pacific on Friday at DocSports.com. All right, let's get to our uh, free pick for Friday. And we're looking uh, at the clash between the Cleveland Indians and the Detroit Tigers. Now, Cleveland is going to send this kid Plutko to the mound. He's going to take on Carpenter. And the thing I like about Plutko is that two of his three starts this season, he's taking care of the long ball. He had that one game in between his first and third start where he gave up some homers to Tampa Bay. But he seems to have it under control in two of his last three starts. He's also uh, facing just what the doctor ordered here because he's going up against the Detroit Tigers. 
Tigers, who are 29th out of 30 teams in Major League Baseball in home runs hit on the season. So I don't think they're going to get to Pluko. The Yankees did it last weekend. He started out slowly in the first inning and then got it together and was fine the rest of the outing. I think he'll be fine here against the Detroit Tigers. If you look at his overall whip, his base runners allowed, it's pretty good for Pluko so far this season. As far as the other side, his counterpart, Carpenter going for the Tigers. Oh my gosh, what a mess this guy's been. Just go check out his home starts this year. Three of his home starts have been absolutely miserable. Something like 21 earned runs, 31 base runners in about 15 innings of work in those three outings. The worst part about this 10 plus ERA this year at home is that it's no different. In fact, it's worse than 2018. He only made five appearances at home last year for the Tigers, but he got beat up. Uh, an ERA of almost eight, a whip of about a buck 75. He had a batting average against of like 350. So he just has continued his really bad struggles at Comerica. So we think Cleveland's going to get to him here. They generally do get to the Detroit Tigers. They've won 45 of the last 63 head-to-head -head meetings with this team. We'll back him here. Our free play for today as we look to go to eight and one with our last nine free picks is the Cleveland Indians on the road over Detroit. That price, by the way, right around $1.40, give or take a few pennies. All right, Cleveland is the free pick. Don't forget when we come back on Saturday morning, uh, we will have not only a free pick for Saturday, but we're also going to have our next NFL thumbnail sketch. That'll be on the Carolina Panthers. And don't forget, there's no NASCAR this week, but we do have UFC going on Saturday. My UFC card will be posted at DocSports.com no later than 11 p.m. Pacific time, Friday night for Saturday's card. So go check that out. All right, that's going to do it for us today on Friday. Go grab that main event, seven you to play in baseball. If you like these videos, click on the thumbs up button. Be sure to subscribe. I'm Scott Spritzer, DocSports.com. You know the drill. Let's put Friday in the win column right back here Saturday morning, 5 a.m. Eastern, 2 a.m. Pacific.